Well, a big part of the guidelines, as you heard, was having teachers and many students wear masks. And that debate continues, with Columbus now joining Dayton to make masks mandatory in public. Tonight, a local councilwoman is looking to bring that change to Akron, too. Here's a Manny Abraham. It's been a topic since the start, but discussion continues to grow over where and when to wear masks. So I will sign an executive order that goes into effect tomorrow that requires the wearing of facial coverings when in public to slow the community spread of COVID-19. The Columbus mayor making the announcement today. It comes just one day after Dayton became the first major city to require face masks in public. It's something Governor Mike DeWine supports, even encouraging other communities to follow the lead. It just really just solidified uh, the reasoning why it needs to be done here in the city of Akron as well. Akron Councilwoman Tara Mosley Samples is working to introduce an ordinance that would require people to wear masks in public places. For the safety of others. And until we have a vaccination and until this pandemic has uh, come off of whatever this surge that we have going on, everyone should want to do this. In Dayton, not wearing a mask could result in an $85 fine. There are some exceptions, like for those who are not able to wear one due to health concerns. A city of Akron spokeswoman says Mayor Dan Horgan is looking at whether a mandatory mask order is necessary based on the latest numbers surrounding COVID-19 cases, but also went on to say that everyone who is medically able to wear a mask in public should do so. There are some details to be worked out in the Akron ordinance, but Sample says she plans to introduce it to City Council by July 13th. I'm Manny Abraham, 3 News.